Hello? Hi, Mom. You want to know how to do what? Okay, today I'm going to show you how to make it easy to run any of the programs that are installed on your computer, not just the ones that have icons down here on the dock. You probably already figured out that if you want to start, let's say, iTunes, you can just click on the iTunes icon and it will start up. But what if you want to start a program that doesn't have an icon down here? Well, let me show you an easy way to set that up. This is one of the first things I do whenever I configure a new Mac. So, let me go click on the Finder icon here. And um, all your programs are stored, programs are also known as applications, and they're stored in a folder called Applications. But one thing that can be confusing here is in the finder under places you'll see a thing called applications and that's one way of finding your applications folder and when you're in the finder this is a handy way of, of getting to your applications but for what we want to do right now you actually need to go up and click on Macintosh HD or whatever your hard drive is named and you'll also find inside of there the applications folder so watch what I'm going to do now. I'm going to click on that and drag it down to the side of the dock near the trash can. And see how it opened up for me there? Now I'm going to let go. Now that will give me access to all the applications. Watch, if I click on it, there are all my applications. Now you can leave it as is. You see the Alphabetically, the first application is the address book, so that's why you get this address book icon. I don't really like that because to me it doesn't, you know, it's irrelevant which is the first one alphabetically. So I'm going to control click on that, and where it says display as, I'm going to change that to folder instead of stack. Now it just shows up as a folder that has kind of this graphic A on it, and it still works the same way. You click on it, and there you get access to all your applications. You know, if you go click on Firefox, that will start up Firefox. Um, iDVD, it will start up iDVD, etc. So, I hope that helps, Mom. Talk to you later.